Connor is back. Is back. <laughs> Hi, my name is Gabby, also known as Mrs. Pigeon. Can you see this? This glow? It was my birthday. And I thought today, all this time afterwards, would be a good time to show you what I got. <laughs> So, I was very lucky. I had my birthday on my birthday. I had family over the following day. And then when I went back to work on the Monday, I had like a work birthday, which is very sweet. <coughs> Any vegan chocolates or sweets I got, I don't know where they went. They just disappeared. She got me three cacti. And now one's dead. One of which is on my desk at work. And the other two are here. This is a plant pot from my sister. I think it was even before Christmas. And then this one I just kept in the pot. So yeah, they're pretty cute. She also got me this cute little book. Is you gonna focus? Oh, you ears! So as you can see, it's got rainbows and space all over it, which is pretty good. I like the seal on the elephant in particular. And she also got me some smiley face highlighters because why not? Some of my friends from work all got me some stuff as well, bless them can't remember who exactly got me what. What I do remember though is that my friend Tia drew me this. La Tia, because that's what I call her. And it says happy birthday Gary and I am a slim thick cat filler. <laughs> I really like that. I'm going to try and find a frame for it. I got this cute cat's farting colouring book <clears throat> and I found my favourite cat in here. He's got his leg in the air while it farts. <laughs> I also got these. <laughs> They're little unicorn boys that pop and unpop. My friend Paige got me these rainbow heart-shaped candles. What? This is a problem with candles, I find. They're made so nice that you don't want to use them. But they are scented! I've got three pairs of socks. The little hedgehogs on them. I got these ones, grey stripy ones with little chicks on. Perfect for Easter, especially. These blue socks with different coloured ducks on. Some are polka dots, some are rainbows, some are unicorns, which is really cute. I've got one of these squishy toys. Oh, it's the unicorn. When it's your birthday at work, everyone gathers around your desk and watches you open your presents, which is terrifying. <laughs> and it's extra awkward, but funny, when you open this. <laughs> like, very stretchy. Can you imagine opening your lunchbox and this is the banana inside, like all folded up like a pretzel. And you just go, bloop. <laughs> you can sort of, no. <laughs> Same. And that's that from the, oh no it's not. I also got this cushion from my friend Shelly. An avocado, thanks. I actually really love avocado, so if someone wrapped that up for my birthday, I'd be more delighted than that child. I also got this heart cushion from my friend Paige. It's from the Valentine's section in Sainsbury's. I remember because I saw it. My birthday is the day after Valentine's Day, if you were wondering. But that's not all. <laughs> my family got me. <laughs> I'll show you these first because they're really cute. So my mum took some pictures of my hamster Nugget. Nugget is actually at my parents house with me now. I can't remember if I ever said that. And then there's also my cat Diego. And then there's my cats at Mark's because like, I miss them every day. <laughs> so it's nice to have them on a mug. My mum also did me this picture of Nugget. He's in a little cup. I also got this. The Book of Monsters. I actually got um, my mum and sister one each for Christmas. And then my brother. I'm really sorry if you can hear my neighbour's kid just screaming. I got my mum and sister one each for Christmas and then my brother got one of them one for Christmas. So they gave it to me. Oh, there's no lines. My mum also got me this little really cool book. It has black pages and you just scratch out and it's like, it's colourful underneath. I didn't even mean to open it on the sunflower. How creepy is that? I started to do this thing. Just doing scrapey scrapies. My mum also got me this little light box. Photo frame keyring, which is really cute. I believe it does light up. Of course it does, it's a light box. My brother and his family got me this cute little Crash Bandicoot Nintendo Switch case, which I thought about using as a pencil case. I do love Crash Bandicoot. My neighbour made me a really nice card. Don't know what my mum's done with it, but I don't think she would have thrown it out. And she also got me these really pretty butterfly earrings. I'm not sure if I'd be able to wear them because I'm allergic to nickel, but I might be able to wear them for a short while. Moving on to stuff my sister got me. One of the things she got me 
is a power bank. Put your phone on it and it charges. How 007 is that? She also got me these mm, little hoop earrings with stars on. Very, very pretty. Oh, she also got me a bunch of skincare stuff which is really good. I've been struggling so much with my skin recently. I think it's like the stress and not sleeping since 2019. So I got some soothing eye balm, primer, hyaluronic booster, some pumpkin and papaya exfoliator. Infinite pamper session. She also got me some cool washi tapes. One of them says explore and then the other one has a little bear and it says wild and free, which is really cool. That might look nice in my bullet journal. She also got me this egg. I'm kidding, it pretend. She also got me this back massager. It is quite possibly one of the coolest things ever. It's like an alien egg getting ready to burst. She also got me a big, like, and I mean big, dairy milk chocolate bar. I kind of misplaced it all in one go. And the last thing that she got me, which is probably my favorite thing, or at least one of my favorite things for my birthday, it's a Nintendo Switch case. Oh, oh I didn't unzip it all the way. Oh, oh, I still didn't unzip it all the way. Oh. So it comes with a case. This, I mean, this was mine. I put it in there, but it's got a little compartment for it. And then it's also got this, which is a strap to wear it like as a shoulder bag. And then here, it's like a a bit where you can slide all the game cartridges in and then here i've just got my red dead redemption 2 game in there for now because my xbox one is still in my lockup oh yeah i also have a tv in my room and now i can watch youtube and netflix in bed a la tele instead of a la telephone or a la laptop and then my Bestest buddies also came. They came on my birthday and we went to Wagamama. Y'all know that if you saw my February favourite. Oh, which I can't remember which order everyone got me stuff. My friends Paul and Amelia got me this cute little fake plant in a little owl pot, which is so cute. I really love cute little plant pots. And I also like fake plants a lot. They also got me these earrings. I'm sure it was them that got me these because of the whole owl thing. I do really love owls, even though my name is Mrs. Pigeon. Um, and they're really beautiful. Now this is where I'm like getting muddled with who got me what. Either my friends Paul and Amelia or my friends James and Shannon got me this lovely photo in a lovely photo frame of us all when we went for a Christmas meal. And I need to find a place in my room to put it. I will find a place and it will be on display. If not, I'll take it to work and put it somewhere on my desk. I can't remember which pair these were from, but whoever it was also got me these really lovely sweet themed and sweet scented candles i must have reached adulthood now because i get excited about socks and candles i've grown up i've actually leveled up a bit if you ignore the other presents <laughs> i do believe these are from my friends james and shannon one of the things i got me is this book called life lessons i learned from my cat and they are really funny little doodles and they have little bits of advice. So I like little things like this. It's like a good little chuckle. Be an early riser, but it's okay to stay in bed longer. They also got me three pairs of socks. Oh, <laughs> I love these little aliens from Toy Story. I have a t-shirt with them on. I have a little Pizza Planet cup with one of them on and it's just, they're cute. Cookie Monster socks. And then also, Joey doesn't share food. I actually have a t-shirt that matches all of these. They also got me a little um, pop, no, phone ring. <laughs> it's really nice. They also got me vegan sweets, but yeah, they... So they also got me some brush pens, which would be really good for my bullet journaling. And I might do a video with them as well. Can I draw with these brush pens? They're beautiful. And that concludes what I got for my birthday. So yeah, this is it for this video. And I'm really sorry if it feels like quite a braggy video. When I did my What I Got For Christmas a couple of years ago, I was worried people would think I was bragging. And I was a bit worried about doing that now for this video, which is why I put it off a little bit. But I kind of wanted to talk about something that brought me joy like all these amazing gifts because I've had quite a struggle with mental health recently which is why I've been a bit slack I think there seems to be a running theme where at the beginning of the year my mental health is really bad and it's 
so bad that I've actually had to seek help from a therapist. But just in case you guys were like, why is she making this video? It's nice to talk about things that make you happy when you're struggling. So maybe I should learn more lessons from the cat. Yeah? Ooh! So thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, you can give the video a like. If you'd like to share it to your buddies, then go ahead. If you'd like to see the rest, you can subscribe to The Pigeon's Nest. Let me know what you want to see next because I always run out of ideas. And don't forget to whack the bell button so that I know you're there, you know I'm there, and we can all just smack bells. Bye!